germs. There are billions and billions and billions of germs. Germs are everywhere around the world. There are billions and billions and billions of germs inside your body. And there are germs as many as there are people that are living on planet Earth inside your body. Germs, there are billions and billions and billions of germs around the world. <laughs> um, uh, all right, kids, let's get the show started. Today, we are talking about germs. Germs, there are good germs and there are bad germs. But today, we are going to talk about the bad, bad, bad germs. When people talk about germs, they are talking about disease-causing microorganisms that can get inside our bodies and make us sick. Scientists call them pathogens. Pathogens in Greek means making disease. Your body is exposed to millions and millions of germs every day and it does a pretty good job at fighting them. This is why taking care of your body, keeping your body clean is very important to staying healthy. This 500 dirham bill is filled with germs. How do you deal with it? Uh, no. No. So, let's talk about how we can take precautions and how do germs move, communicable and non-communicable. Let's go. Let's say this kind of paint is a disease. This paint can slosh around and communicable disease come from the root word communicate. That means to share. So, communicable disease, they can slosh around and they can spread around and be shared with other people. And if that happens, it can cause a worldwide sickness. And there is another type of disease that doesn't communicate from person to person like this type of paint, it does not slosh around. So, this does not spread from person to person. It does not communicate. So, it's a non-communicable disease. So, right now, let's pretend that this paint is ready to infect us and it's seeding and it's ready to go and transfer from person to person. If I were to touch it and I have all of this disease or all of these germs on my hand and then I touch the water and then I fill up the water in here, look what happens. Everything is infected. Better yet, Aisha, Amna, can you come please? Hi, can you shake hands with Amna? Ew, why did you do that? It's communicable disease. So, communicable disease can communicate through touch. You can see they can communicate through touch if I touch things or touch surfaces. Also, communicable disease can communicate through wind if I were to sneeze. <gasps> That's why it is very important that we sneeze inside our elbows, otherwise, we will spread the germs everywhere and it's communicable disease we are sharing it with other people that's why they say contagious infectious communicable germs 
Communicable disease can also communicate from human to human, animal to human, human to animal, and they can spread all around the world. So it is very important that we keep clean, take proper hygiene, wash our hands with warm water and soap for at least 20 seconds. Um, what am I going to do with all of this? Remember, germs are everywhere and the best way for you to protect yourself is to wash your hands with soap and warm water. <laughs> Alright kids, that's all about germs. Don't forget to wash your hands with soap and warm water and always remember, stay safe and make healthy choices. Bye.